Hello everyone and welcome to episode one of the Three Sisters Side Hustle Show. In today's episode, we are going to be making cookies. So Mandy is going to take us along on her cookie making journey and show us the steps for her order. So what type of cookies are we making today? Mandy? Making iced sugar cookies today. And okay. we have a puppy order due, so we'll be doing a dog themed birthday. All right, so let's get this order going. Okay, so this order is only for 18 cookies. So um, as you guys can see here, I'm cutting them out with cookie cutters and putting them on some parchment paper on a tray. And these bake in the oven for about 10 minutes at 350 degrees until the bottom is just slightly, slightly brown. Okay, this one is a paw print, and as you can see, there's these cutters in here, but it doesn't cut the whole way through, so this one is what you call a guide cutter, and as you can see, it outlines what you need to cut and ice. So what you guys didn't see, because it is a long process, is making the actual dough. So I have my secret recipe that I cannot tell anyone. I'll have to kill you. Really? It's the Mandy's secret cookie formula, like the Krabby Patty secret formula. Um, but I roll it all out and then I put it in the fridge for about an hour so that it can harden up so it's easier to cut out cookies so they're not sticking everywhere. And then whenever I'm done cutting these ones out, I'll show you guys how I re-roll it and cut out the shapes again. Okay, so right now I'm repurposing my dough since I just cut out some of the cookie cutters because we don't like to waste. And this is actually a really super cool um, rolling pin I got off of Amazon. And it has guides here. So you know exactly how thick to make your cookie. So it's super helpful and saves so much time whenever I have big cookie orders. So sounds fine. And then this will be in, I'll put this back in the fridge until my next cookie order that I need to make later today. Okay, so now we're making icing. As you can see, I put a damp paper towel over top of this to keep our icing from hardening over, but I'm gonna show you guys how we make um, the icing a certain color. So I'm gonna put some brown in here for the dog's ears. So you can kind of keep adding the food coloring until you get the color that you want. This is looking like a little bit more of a chocolate brown, so we'll make it a little bit darker. So we'll just add a little bit more. And the color develops over time. So if you leave it in there for about two minutes after you're done stirring it, it'll darken or lighten depending on the color that you choose. Okay, so now we're gonna fill our piping bag and it's super easy to do. Just put it directly in just to avoid air bubbles. Get off all the excess. And then I take it and push it down as far as it'll go. Twist the top 
and I use hair ties. Disclaimer, all of these are new hair ties and have never actually been used in here. That's kind of neat. And once you have it done, you can take it and helicopter your bag to get out all of the air bubbles. <laughs> All right, guys, so this is the super focused part of the cookie making. Mandy is piping the dog bone now. So she's just using the icing that she made and she likes to go out around the rim of the cookie and then goes in and starts to flood, is the terminology, flood the inside. Then once she's done, she'll just shake it a little bit to make it a little bit even. And then she will poke any air bubbles that there are. So that way the icing is all smooth. All right, so she did the dog bone. Now she is going to do the paw print and she's gonna do it in two phases. She's going to pipe the brown icing first for the middle parts and then she needs to let it dry for a little bit and she's going to go out around with some white icing and you need to let it wait and harden up so that way the colors do not bleed into each other. Okay, so we left you guys hanging, but here is the final product. We have some paw prints, some cute little girly puppies, and some bones with the name of the birthday girl, Isla, on it. Okay, so here we have both of our boxes filled and they are ready to get delivered today. All right, guys, so that finishes off our episode one of the Three Sisters Side Hustle little segment that I'm doing on my channel here. Today we got to watch Mandy create a cookie order. So now we're just going to talk to Mandy a little bit about how to connect with Mandy if you're interested in keeping up with her cookie adventures or maybe want to place an order with her. So do you want to tell us a little bit about how so they can get in contact with you? the easiest way to get a hold of me is going on my Instagram at Mandy's underscore cookie co. You, you can place an them? order by DMing me. I can ship orders if you would like an order and I would love to create for you guys. So I'll be sure to link all of her info in the description bar below. So definitely go ahead and check out her Instagram and connect with her on Instagram over there. But thank you so much for tuning in today, guys. Thank you, Mandy, for showing us Thanks your cookie for watching. adventures. And so we will for sure show some more cookie adventures in the future and if you are interested in keeping up with the three sisters side hustle segment here on the channel be sure to hit the subscribe button down below so that you way you are up to date on all of the episodes so thanks guys and we will see you next time bye